So obviously your group had coming off a physical battle against a physical team in BYU. Uh, kind of reviewing the tape, what were some of your big takeaways from that win? I uh, really like the way um, the spine of our defense played, uh, the inside guys. Um, we kind of put the onus on them to step it up, and they did. Um, edge, guys, edge guys had some, some tests with the speed option and whatnot, and I think everybody kind of held and, and, and stood the task. So the, the last couple of games, you know, strong first halves and then kind of the, the opponent making a little run in the second half. What were some of the, th the, the reasons behind that or maybe some of the things, the action items that can be put that's, forth? That's there? a great question. I'm trying to crack the code on that right now. So whatever it is in the water at halftime or whatever it is, you know, we got to crack the code on that. We can't let that continue to happen. So here, you know, with this team now at 9-2 and two and kind of riding, you know, in control of, of their destiny for the most part, what's kind of your read on it? It's kind of the, the mindset and the collective, uh, you know, uh, mentality of this team right now. You know, I think everybody's, like, really curious about what's next. But, you know, the only way that you get to what's next is you handle your business. So, you know, I think everybody has a, you know, business mindset, and in, you know, including, you know, having the holidays amongst us and whatnot. But, you know, I, I think everybody is eager to get to work and, and, and get the job done. What's really kind of maybe impressed you most over the course of, you know, these last, you know, 12, 13 weeks uh, from the opener to the, the right now? Just, just the focus of the guys, you know, they're holding each other accountable. You know, they're pushing each other, you know, um, to the next you know, limit, next level. Um, you know, I like the way guys are like, um, you know, they don't flinch. You know, no, no matter what goes on in the game, these guys don't flinch on offense or defense. So that's been really good. Um, seeing our guys just, you know, go to the next play, you know, fix it mentality. And, you know, when the next guy's up, they're pushing and cheering them on as well. So the uh, the pass rush, the, the sack numbers haven't been there, but of course, you know, that's not a, a complete picture. What's your analysis of just kind of maybe the, the pass rush and the success or some things that can do to improve heading into this week? Oh, shoot, we just got to get to the quarterback, man. No, we just got to find a way to do it. Um, you know, just, just, you know, make sure we make the most of our opportunities. That's the biggest thing. You know, we left a few out there, you know, the past few games and whatnot. Missed a couple. We just got to get them when they come to us. You know, I, I try to tell them not to chase the sacks. They'll come to you. They'll come to you in bunches. Just continue to do your job, and, you know, we'll get the win. And that's the most important thing. Obviously, U of A has got a pretty potent uh, quarterback com uh, receiver combo and Fafita uh, T-Mac. Um, best pass defense might be to just make sure the quarterback never throws the ball. Uh, what are some of the things that, uh, you know, you, you jump out to you about this Wildcat offense? Um, the, the biggest thing is the quarterback. I mean, he makes them go. You know, those two guys you just mentioned, you know, they make them go. You know, um, being able to contain the quarterback, you know, the way he runs around, the way he gets the ball out and whatnot. Um, if we can find a way to, to affect him and, and, and slow um, T-Mac down a little bit, you know, we have a chance to have a chance. You've been a part of some really successful teams, Super Bowl champion, of course. You know, when you look at those you know, championship caliber teams, what are some of the similarities, some, some, some traits that the Sun Devil team has in common with them? You know, the biggest thing is, you know, the ability for these guys to be able to refocus, you know, um, enjoy the win, you know, be able to, um, to, to calibrate it, you know, look at it, and then refocus and get to the next half. That's the biggest thing. They're able to move on and not just hang on the, 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 the short little victories.